I'm Venetia Considine, Director of Development and Community Relations for Legal Aid Center of Southern Nevada, and I'm here today with our 2019 Melanie Kushner Access to Justice Fellow. Brittany, would you please introduce yourself? I'm Brittany Tannenbaum, and I'm a rising 2L at Boyd, and I'm the Melanie Kushner Fellow this year. Can you tell us why you applied for the Melanie Kushner Fellowship? Yeah, so I've been involved in public interest work since 2004, and so when I saw this opportunity, I was really excited. Um, before law school, I worked with young people in a variety of capacities, but mostly around upholding their rights and making sure that they had what they need to be successful. Um, so when I heard about the fellowship, I was really excited to have the opportunity to learn about different needs and issues here in the local community and to start working on those. What did you know about the fellowship that led you to apply for it? So I knew that the fellowship was in honor of Melanie Kushner, the former pro bono director here at Legal Aid Center. Um, and the, the fellowship is for a law student who is very passionate about public interest work and wants to learn more about how they can support local community members. So the Melanie Kushner Fellow spends the entire summer with the Pro Bono Project at Legal Aid Center. So can you give me the top four or five things that you've done in this past summer? Yeah, so I've been able to do a lot of great things this summer. I think the most important thing is being able to learn about everything that Legal Aid Center does, the different departments. I was able to shadow them. I was able to actually work on some things. So my second thing that it was really exciting is I actually did two Social Security cases where I met with the clients and then I was mentored to write the briefs and I also appeared in court and represented the clients. So that was really exciting. Um, I also got to go to the annual state bar meeting where I did the trial academy and so especially only being a 2L this coming year, I was able to work on all those trial skills before I'm even going to my second year of law school. So that was really great and I was able to network with other, pe uh, with other people at the state bar conference as well. Um, another great thing I was able to do is I was able to make, meet with different people in the community who are working on access to justice issues um, and I was able to talk to them about different ideas and work on projects with them. And then I think something that was really great as well is I was able to work on a rule change um, for the state of Nevada. Um, I was able to work with Barbara Buckley to change a rule with the Nevada Supreme Court to allow more attorneys to do pro bono work. So out of everything that you've just told us that you've done, what is, what is the one that you're most proud of? I really think that the rule change is the thing that I'm most proud of. I think it really captures something that Melanie would have worked on as well. Um, and endorsed. It's really important to have more attorneys involved in pro bono work and through this rule change people who are limited under licensed under limited practice certification here in Nevada are able to automatically do pro bono work now. So we have more attorneys that will be available to support our clients. Seems like a lot. Awesome. Yeah. So if a law student comes up to you and asks you about the fellowship, how will you explain what your experience has been to somebody who is interested in applying next year? I would say to them it's a really great experience. You're able to actually start working on things to support community members here. Um, you're able to learn about the different civil legal needs. You have a lot of mentorship and there are a lot of great attorneys here that can really help guide you and figure out different ways that you can bring your legal career thereafter, but you really get to support community members during your summer. Thank you, it was an honor to have you here this summer. Thank you.